Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. Um, today's the 25th of May. I'm catching a plane tomorrow morning quite early at Luton Airport to go to Geneva because I have a concert tomorrow evening with one of the biggest brass bands of Switzerland and it's gonna be an amazing concert. Unfortunately, the French on strike again. I feel like they're always on strike and I'm not gonna lie. I am French and I'm so annoyed by it and I'm like, just get a, f a grip. Do something else that doesn't affect people who actually need to take a plane to do a paid gig at home. Um, <laughs> so I hope this vlog is actually going to be possible and like is going to be followed to Switzerland because I mean... Thank you, the French, for being on strike again and making me stress the night before a gig, before I need to wake up at 3 a.m. to get to the airport on time, not even knowing if my flight is going to be cancelled or not. <laughs> Cannot wait. <laughs> so, apart from that, the gig sounds incredibly well. We've rehearsed, like, they have rehearsed much more than I because they're all over there, but because I am in London, I've only been able to attend one rehearsal. So I've worked really hard on all my harmonies and all my songs. And I was like, trust me, I will be on point. I will know everything by then. And they trust me, which is great. And I'm really happy and it's a lot of pressure. Apart from that, I'm really looking forward to it because it's with people that I love as well. And yeah, I hope you're gonna enjoy this little vlog and I hope it's actually, I'm actually gonna be able to take you to Switzerland with me. Cause if not, it's gonna be very sad. But it's gonna happen. We're all gonna go to Switzerland, you and I together. Anyway, I'll see you in a second.
guys um so i'm filming like a week after what you've seen so well done clara um so yeah i've just put a few little extracts of the concert for you to kind of watch and have a little taste of um it was so nice to go back and see some of my incredible friends and just have fun um because it's true that erdang is an incredible school and it's teaching us so much but sometimes you just forget to have fun and this concert just reminded me of what is it like to feel like you're having fun doing what you love and not being assessed on anything or being judged all the time and it was just very nice to have that as well as doing all my rehearsals with Erdang. I'm still in love with Erdang, it's just that it's a lot of pressure and being able to take this pressure out by doing that kind of show is so nice. And um, I feel extremely lucky that I've been able to go back and do that show with incredible musicians, incredible singers, uh, such a funny pre presenter as well. Like he was so funny and so into it and just so lovely. Everyone was just so lovely. And yeah, such a great experience and I really hope there's going to be a, like a part two of that experience, fingers crossed, because we just had so much fun. Literally, that was the word everyone used when we were finished with it, when we went to the bar and like greet everyone and everyone told us we could see that you were having fun on stage and this is literally what happened. We, we were all having an absolutely magical time and yeah so i hope you enjoyed this little vlog give it a big thumbs up if you did and subscribe to my channel if you want more videos and i'll see you all very soon Mwah!